Hey guys, uh, d and still here. So for d and we're going to a area that's gonna be a dungeon finally. So I thought I'd make a dungeon tile, but I wanted to share with you guys cause it's hella cheap. I have to literally just in the trash pile. Uh, this form board is from Dollar Tree. You wanna get the cheapest from Dollar Tree cause this comes off the paper. So it's all boards so you're able to, you know, uh, detail it very easily. Uh, for the tools, I mean, this is a cardboard. It's already kind of warping, so I need to kind of push it down. But if you can find that double corrugated one that's like a little thicker than the regular, I'll be perfect. Uh, I use this piece for a ruler <laughs> to make the lines, so that's why they're a little jacked. But I mean, it looks kind of more realistic, I think, the more messed up it looks. So that's fine. I use this for a ruler, this to make the lines, and then just a little razor blade I found. Uh, for cutting out the the square here so as you can see pretty straightforward right just make, make, just make the lines of the pen the squares once the squares are written out you need a uh, was a soldering soldering tool to make the imprints deeper I didn't have one because I'm hella broke so I took out the glue from this hot glue gun and I'm just using the tip of it if I can show you a little bit here so just with the tip of it I'm just carving out the lines first and then I'll go into carving out the make each square round so it looks better but yeah check it out don't even need to go and buy a soldering tool if you have a hot glue gun save your money you could buy way better stuff for 10 bucks but yeah check it out just wanted to show you guys Alright, thanks for watching.